<laughs> All right. Well, I started. I started doing tricks with my hands before I started to do parkour, like way back. And then I started to do parkour when I was working at the Cirque with the Yamaka C guy from France. And I kind of quit skating for a few years. And then after that, I just I saw Damon Wilson do some cool shit. And I'm like, yeah, why not? And I just tried it, and it's so much more fun. It's so much, so much more I can do now. Oh, I think it's I think it's dope. It's pretty inspiring. That, that just that itself proves like proves that like. It proves that the people are open-minded too. Like I can, I, I grew up doing just regular tricks and switch-ups and tech shit. And after that, it just got boring for me. So seeing people doing that, it's like, yeah, it's cool. I saw Montre do one too. Props to that. <laughs> it depends. If I'm juiced, I just, I just see the tricks in my head first. I have like a vision and I just want to, I need to get it out. It's, it's almost like someone put an idea in my mind. It, it needs to go through me to get accomplished somehow. So that, that's what, yeah, what happened. Well, I don't consider myself, re now yeah, but involved as, like when I watch people like James and Gretchen, people that own shops that are working their ass off, people that have companies that work their ass Stuff, like just to make the, the end of the month those guys those people should have the, the respect they deserve I just skate basically and have fun um, yeah that's what I think well I love what I do and I want to be able to do it as, as long as I can so um, I make sure I, I take care of my my instrument because this is my instrument that allows me to do what I love to do Um, life, man. I just love being a human being on this planet right now. It's like a one-time deal, or maybe I have we have past life, but I know as right now, it's cool, man. Just I know, just meeting people and sharing stuff and learning about myself and experiences. And just being here on this planet with all of us. Well, I like to dig deep into my consciousness. I like to know why I think the way I think, why I act the way I act, otherwise I'm just a freaking robot. You know, you, you do things related to your past and every, choose, every choice you make is based on your past. So basically for me going to Peru is just learning about myself and digging deeper into my, my mind. Um, I don't know, it's kind of in the air, like, when the when first the first shop closed, the structure closed, it just went dead. And then somehow, right now it's booming. Well, we have two shops right now in Quebec. We have Lilac in Montreal, and we have the structure in Quebec. And I'm involved with Lilac, with Guillaume. And he's working hard too, like, like James and Gretchen. And I think just all the OGs are coming back, and all those new kids at the park, and it's just, everyone is super having fun, and it's, it feels good, yeah. It does affect a lot because like example for the last six months I was working on a TV show almost full time and I can't go around and get hurt skating because I look like a dumb because I have a contract I have a deal with them so basically my skating all always in and out in and out which is kind of annoying because you progress progress and then yeah and then you have to go back go back there but at the same time, it makes me feel missing skiing, so it's cool because when I come back, I'm all excited. But yeah, it does affect my skiing for sure. I think being cool means being yourself, respect yourself and respect others. I think if you think you're cool, you're not cool. You know what I mean? I'm the shit, I'm cool. All right, you're not cool then. <laughs> you know what I mean? But if you're just down the hurt, just like me, just like people that you know and you have fun with, now you're cool. Someone get good at skating and then suddenly they're cool in their head, oh, I'm good, I'm cool. Yeah, I'm special, right? No, all you do is you skate more, that's all you do, it doesn't, you know what I mean? Yeah, sometimes people uh, look at me like I'm, I'm cool because I do stunts for movies or TV shows, but basically, 
I'm not transforming the world. I'm not doing anything special, really. I'm not Nelson Mandela. Or I'm not Gandhi. I'm just a regular stuntman who do action shows. Like, so for me, it's just it's a regular job. I love my job. It's fun, but I don't think I'm special because of that. I think it gets everything it needs. Like real estate itself, all you need is a strap, pair of skate, go blade. That's all it needs. Just that feeling. And just you guys just need more people, that's all. Like people are involved right now are so passionate about it. And we see like, yeah, basically just more people involved, just more new kids. And then everything else will follow, for sure. My name is Matt Ledoux and you're watching me. Me, me, on the spot, just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> Sick. Uh,